Today we play through all floors of Bowser's Tower in Mario Party Island where we play as Yoshi. There are incredible boss fights and very fun mini games. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoy this video. This game is from 2013. That is 10 years ago. Can you guys believe it? Okay, it looks like Mario and Yoshi are a little tired. Here's Peach and this is on the 3DS so you can see that the graphics are a little bit dated. It's crazy to think that this game is from 10 years ago. Oh look, you're invited. Join us on the party yeah. islands in the sky. Everyone's like, yes, I love the party islands in the sky. Wait, what is this? Is it going to explode? Oh my goodness, bubbles came out and everyone's trapped in bubbles. I love how Toad just floated up. Toad is like, hey, Mario, I'm often in bubbles like this. Yoshi's like, wah, 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 Yoshi makes that sound right. Wow, Yoshi's still swimming like that. Mario's like, eh, Mario, what are we doing in here? Hey, Mario, you got to help me. That was Luigi over there. And here we are. Oh, I guess this is the island in the sky that we made it to. So that's how the game starts. What is going to happen now? Oh, Mario and Toad and Luigi are walking around. Peach and Daisy talking by the garden. Yeah, yeah, I'm a boo. That's what that guy's saying over there. And look who's watching. It was just another magical day on the Potty Islands. Our heroes were laughing and playing games. When all of a sudden, look who it is. What's this? Why wasn't I invited to the party? Bah, I'll make my own party. What kind of party did he say I didn't read? Oh, and this attack, this reminds me of Mewtwo's attack from Super Smash Bros. And Bowser made a giant tower. And with that, he built Bowser's Tower, a fearsome monument to his terrible power. Oh, look how he jumps off the clown car. You're all invited to join me at this party. I've got some great ideas for party favors. <laughs> What do you have in mind, Bowser? What are we gonna do? Bowser got to work locking away at the fun of the party islands into all kinds of weird bubbles. This is the greatest crisis the party islands have ever faced. And look at Yoshi hopping around. I love the sound of Yoshi jumping. Can our heroes defeat Bowser and save the party islands? Or will Bowser have the last laugh? What's going to happen? And lightning strikes, great pathetic fallacy. Okay, this is a great intro to the game over here. Look at all of the floors on this tower. Will we be able to clear them all? Hey, Yoshi, wait for me. Who can it be? It's a green toad. Oh, heard that you're going to try climbing Bowser's tower. And I thought I might be able to help you. What do you think? Want me to tag along? Yoshi's like, Yoshi. All right, I'll do my best. And let's go tackle the tower. Into the first floor we go. What? We have a visitor. It looks like Yoshi, here to try and stop me from making more bubbles, no doubt. Oh, but it's far too late. Nothing can stop me now. Whoa, <laughs> minions, head out and stop the trespasser. Bowser's Tower, floor one. So what mini game should we play, left or right? Ah, looks like these doors lead to different mini game battles. Oh, that's right. And I almost forgot that we actually have to battle people. It's Bubble Mario's. That's our first boss fight. Well, not boss fight, but our first enemy. Yoshi versus the Bubble Marios. Ah, look at those. They're like weird bubble clones of Mario. They must be Bowser's creations. I could be wrong, but I think you'll need to win a minigame to get past one of these doors. But if that's not what we have to do at all. All right, which minigame do you want to play? Claiming the cube or rope a slope? Let's do claiming the cube. Jump and ground pound to color the white panels as they appear on the cube. This is going to be easy. Oh, this is so cool how the cube moves like this. Okay, that was the demonstration. Now the minigame begins. Okay, let's go get some colored panels. Or uh, the white panels, I guess. Whoa, hey, you took those from me. Hey, you took that one from me. Oh no, these guys are actually good. How are they so good? Oh, 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 give me those. Okay, we got three there, that's fine. Give me that one. Hey, I squished them. I squished them. Whoa, whoa, you're not taking those from me. Oh boy, oh boy, there's four right there. Oh boy, give me that one. Ah, uh, there's gonna be some right there. Four, nice. Let's go, another four. Oh man, I keep flattening them. And how many do we have? Oh, we've got a lot actually. Oh my goodness, 28. Okay, so we kind of destroyed those bubble Marios. Yoshi's sounds are so great. Oh no, look at the Marios they're defeated. So sad, and they turn into bubbles. Now we're gonna go through the door and head up to the next floor of the tower, right? Oh, nice, and a Yoshi egg appears there. Up the tower we go. Look at this go around. Oh my goodness. There are going to be so many floors here. And I think, if I remember correctly, every fifth floor is a boss fight, actually. So what's it going to be now? More Mario bubbles. And I think as we go up, the enemies change and also the difficulty gets harder. So we got to face off some more Mario bubbles here. What a cool idea for a game. We can do hair today. 
or tile savvy. Let's go with hair today. Catch the rabbits and put them in the pen as fast as you can. This sounds simple enough, doesn't it? Okay, here's the demonstration. I love how Toad picks up the rabbit like that. That's so adorable. Okay, so we want to pick up rabbits. Oh, give me that. Let's go. Give me that. Let's go. Oh, there's a rabbit. Give me that rabbit. That's my rabbit. Hey, hey. Okay, let's see. Wait, did they also say that there were going to be golden rabbits? Oh, oh, and you could actually miss a rabbit. Okay, let's go. Let's pick up some rabbits. Let's go. Getting the rabbits. I don't know why I thought for some reason there'd be gold rabbits. Oh, that guy stole the rabbit from right under my nose. Let's go. Okay, got another one here. Okay, let's... Oh, there are gold rabbits. Oh, someone got a gold rabbit. Oh, no. Let's see. Oh, I didn't get the gold one. Okay, but we still did win with 12 points. Very nice. Okay, so more Marios are defeated over here, which is so sad for them. And we get to go through this door and go to the next floor. Through the door to the next floor. It's nice that that rhymes. Okay, floor number three. Is it still- Oh, it's Bowser now. Not so fast. Before I allow you to play another minigame, I've got a surprise for you. Usually when Bowser has a surprise, it's not something good. It's a random punishment. Because <laughs> climbing the tower isn't hard enough already. We'll just take a quick look at Bowser's list and see what fun, delightful penalty I get to inflict. Fun! Please don't be start over on the first floor. Go directly to the top floor. All right, it's decided. You are hereby invited to the top floor. Wait, what? I can't allow that. What kind of boss would I be if I just let heroes visit my fortress without a fight? That would be the ultimate speed run if you could just get that right away. Whoa, <laughs> sorry to get your hopes up, but you'll still have to reach the top floor all by yourself. It's good that we didn't get sent back down to the first floor. That would be so sad. Okay, who are we facing off against now? Oh, more Bubble Marios. Okay, so soon is gonna be other Bubble characters. I wonder if we'll face off against Bubble Yoshis. Let's do Get Along, Goomba. So in this one, you use this stylus to draw circles to widen your lasso, and then you slide it to throw it, and you wanna catch as many Goombas as possible. All right, let's go. I am ready. This is such an exciting one. This is a very exciting one. Okay, so you wanna make a big lasso like that, and then throw it. Hopefully you don't have to draw very big circles. Let's see how this works. Okay, I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's go. And you also want to catch the Goombas before the others can get them. Okay, so let's see. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh, that was not good. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's go, go. And yeah, 12 Goombas. All right, let's go. Okay, so I guess timing is more important. My first throw wasn't good. Go, come on. Okay, not bad, seven. Okay, we're still ahead. This is all right. I just don't want to go at a time where they're about to get a lot. Okay, that was not bad. Okay, go. Oh, I got almost nothing there. That was so sad. Okay, but still 30 for us, so we still win. So sad for Bubble Marios. Goodbye, Bubble Mario. So sad. Oh, that's right. And we actually chose this door. This time we went through the door on the right. So far, we've been going through the left door. But it doesn't really matter which door you go through. It's just you get a choice of which mini game you want. And sometimes it's probably going to be a luck-based versus a skill-based minigame. Oh, look at this! We now have Bubble Daisies over here instead of Bubble Marios as we had earlier. So we'll probably have Bubble Princess Peaches later. Oh my goodness! Those look just like Daisy! I'm kind of creeped out! Okay, which minigame do we want to play? Great Bars of Fire or Goomba to Maneuver? Let's do Great Bars of Fire. So you use the D-pad to duck down. A is jump. Duck and jump to avoid the spinning fire bars. I'm ready. Hopefully we can avoid these fire bars. Okay, so you want to duck when that comes. Then you want to jump when that passes by. Okay. Hopefully my timing is all right. Let's see. Let's duck. Nice. Jump. Duck. Okay, nice. Jump. Oh boy, I almost jumped into it. I'm so scared. Jump. Okay, we haven't been hit yet. Oh boy, I thought that one would hit me. All right, we made it. No damage for us. Amazing victory. And now all of the daisies are defeated. So sad for them. They look so sad. Okay, so we're going through the left door. Oh, and now it's going to be a boss fight, isn't it? Because we're getting to floor five. I think every fifth floor is a boss, if I remember correctly. Yeah, look, there's a Bowser icon on the door. So this must be a boss fight here. Oh, what's it going to be? It looks so dark right now. Whoops, someone forgot to turn on the lights in here. Maybe they didn't forget to. Maybe they purposefully did this. Can you guys see what it is? Leave a comment if you know what it is. That's okay. I'm not scared. And the camera zooms in. Gah! Correction! I am now scared. There's a massive Goomba Tower straight ahead. This Goomba Tower boss is such a cool boss fight. All the boss fights in this game are so great. Hit the Goomba Tower with a red nut to knock it over, and then attack the fallen Goombas with more red nuts before they can regroup. This should be fine, right? Oh, the music's so nice and cheerful here. Look at all the Goombas just stacking up. I love the Goomba sounds. The Goomba sounds are so great. So let's get some of these red nuts. But wait, they look like apples. Why does Yoshi turn around like that before a battle? 
Wait. Pick it up, bro. Pick it up. Let's go. There we go. Okay, we got them there. Now let's just aim nicely. Oh, I didn't hit all of them. That's not good. Get him. Yeah, there we go. We got them all. All right, let's go. Oh, but I know that for some of these spots, the stuff that falls down might actually... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, sometimes there might actually be spiky things that fall down. Oh, boy. They fell onto that. That's not good. Okay, let me pick up this. Go. Yeah. All right. Oh, the music that's playing is so nice. Okay, I'm going to hold this apple. Yeah, sometimes spiky things might fall down instead of nuts, and we'll be in trouble if that happens. Okay, so let's go. Yes, they just fell straight. That's great. Kind of straight. And yeah, got a ball. Okay. Oh, and the boss is half defeated, as you guys can see. And in this game, as well as in Mario Party 10, when the bosses are half defeated, they get angry. It looks like it's an even bigger Goomba stack now. So Yoshi's a little afraid here. Oh, and now the Goomba stack's running towards us. Okay, let's see. Yeah, over there, those spiky ones. We actually can't pick up those spiky ones. We want to be careful. Let's see, where are you guys going? Let's go like that. Now, where are you falling? Oh, over there. This is perfect, actually, because I could go like that. Oh, no, I missed one. Bam, there we go. Got the last one. Okay, that's great. Oh, and I don't want the Goombas to run into me as they start to uh, make a stack. There we go. Just threw that right at them. Okay, now can I get them all like this? Hopefully. Let's go. Oh, I keep missing the last one. Go. There we go. Took him out. Now, watch out, guys. Watch out, guys. We haven't taken damage yet. Can we do this boss damage list? Let's see. Throw that at him. Hey, now, come on. Now, just get a nice throw right there. Bam! Defeated him. All right. They're all out of HP. That was a great boss fight. Man, the boss fights in this game are so satisfying to do. And look at Yoshi's flat hands there because this is on the Nintendo 3DS. All right. That was a great victory that we had there. Wow. You did it, Yoshi. Of course. I totally do. You can do it. Thank you, Toad. Toad is such a great partner. He gives great commentary. Oh, looks like Bowser has something to say. Oh, you knocked over my Goomba Tower. Boo-hoo. I have a million of those. Oh, here's the next boss, guys. If you know what this boss fight is going to be, leave a comment. Besides, I have other ways of keeping you out. More formidable guards with fangs and scary noises. Just you wait. Oh, I'm a little scared of what that boss is going to be. I think a lot of people might know what that is. You won't make it much farther. <laughs> All right, floor six. Is it still going to be Daisy or is it going to be something else now? Oh, both of these mini games look like such great choices. Okay, it's still Bubble Daisies. We can do Cannonball or Magmathon. Let's do Magmathon. Jump from rock to rock by quickly pressing the buttons that appear. Be careful, false steps waste time. This is going to be easy. Okay, so all we have to do is press A, B, X, Y, and we have to press it in the right order. Okay, so over there you want to press A. Okay, let's get ready. A, nice X, A, Y, Y, B, Y, A, A, B, A, X, A, X, and is that it? Hooray, we won. All right, a new record for the time, very nice. I don't know what the record was before this. I don't know if there was no record or if the record was 20 or something maybe to start. I don't think we've played before on this file. Okay, so that's floor six completed. So on the next floor or the floor after that, we're probably going to have a new bubble enemy. So let's head on up another floor of the tower. It's so funny seeing Yoshi just quickly run up like that. Uh-oh! Not so fast. Before I allow you to play another mini game, I've got a surprise for you. It's a random punishment. <laughs> climbing the tower isn't hard enough already. So we'll just take a quick look at Bowser's list and see what delightful penalty I get to inflict. Fun. Okay, please don't be something too bad. It is... Bowser's underlings get way tougher. Whoa, this ought to be fun. Good luck getting past my underlings now that they're way tougher. I suppose this makes up for me not giving them a bonus this year. Whoa, <laughs> Bowser's so evil. Well, off you go. Good luck in the mini games now that you're facing stiffer competition. <laughs> well, you know what? It was kind of easy so far. So let's see if this gets much more difficult. And is it still Daisy or someone else now? Okay, still Daisy. So this is probably the last time that we're facing Bubble Daisies. Oh, and they've got red glowing around them. Watch out, Yoshi! Bowser wasn't getting what he said his underlings would be getting tougher. Yeah, they look much tougher. Musical snares or Helter Shelter? Let's do Helter Shelter for this one. Guess which shell contains the most pearls? Okay, so this is a luck-based one. Hopefully we can have some good luck here. I would guess the left one here. And that is very nice. Hopefully we can maintain that luck going forward into this mini game. Okay, so let's start. What are we going to do? Okay, let's see. Which one shall we pick? Let's go for it. You know, this one's kind of unique. Let's pick this one. How many pearls are in here? Hopefully a lot. 
two. Okay, that's a decent start. Okay, the green one in the bottom left has three points. Well, that's okay. I'd like to... You know, let's go for green, because we're a green Yoshi. Let's pick up a green shell. And we get three. Very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, and... We're in first. Let's go for... Why not go for this green one over here? That could be a nice one for us. And we get... Three! Let's go! Okay, but they also got three, so that's a little scary. We're a little bit ahead. We might be able to win this if things go very well. Let's go for green. I'm a green Yoshi. I'm getting a green shell. What if they don't pick up a shell in time? They probably almost guaranteed you. Wait, do we win? Do we win or no? We tied red, so what's going to happen? Okay, it still says winner! Wait, even though we tied them, we defeated two of them, but one of them still survived, so what happens? Do I have to battle that one again? And... They're all defeated! Thank goodness! Oh man, that's amazing! Okay, and we just get to continue through here. That's amazing! Oh boy, I was actually a little worried about that, but I'm very glad that that happened. Okay, let's go to our next floor. Floor Hey, I love how Yoshi walks quickly like that. Okay, and where are we can- Oh, there are toads now! Bubble toads! Look at them! What's Toad gonna say about this? Ah! It's me! And there are three of me! Well, this might sound weird, but do your worst to me! That's so funny! Toad is so great! Hey, which mini game shall we play? Mad Ladders? Or Diamond a Dozen. I think this is a luck-based one, so let's do Mad Ladders. Mad Ladders! Race up the ladders while avoiding the boulders thrown by the stone spikes. So here's a minigame that makes use of both screens on the Nintendo 3DS. And we want to climb up while avoiding those rocks that are thrown down at us, so let's be careful. And also these ladders are arranged in an interesting way, so let's see where we gonna go. Hey! Hey, bro, get out of my way! Whoa! Okay, let's go. Oh, go! No, I wasn't high enough. I wasn't high enough. Oh, wait, wait. Where are the others? Where in the world are the others? Oh, I'm not fast enough there. Okay, go. Okay, I just made it through that one. That's fine. Bro, where are you guys going? Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't follow me, guys. Don't follow me, guys. Don't follow me. Do not follow me on any social media. A lot of people always say, follow me on this, follow me on this, but I'm like, don't follow me. Ah, uh, right, the toads have been defeated. Ah, oh, that's so sad how they sit down like that, so sad. Okay, so we're going to floor nine, that means it's going to be a boss fight soon. After the next floor, it's going to be the next boss fight. And you guys saw a little preview of who that boss fight is going to be. So let's face off against these toads again. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's go face off against these toads. Let's go, toads. Which mini game do we want to play? Fist to Clouds? Or Puzzle Pronto. Let's do Fist of Clouds because this one looks fun. Fist of Clouds. Bonk your opponent over the edge. Last player standing win. He can jump and putt. I'm ready to take you guys on time to knock out some toads. This is gonna be a little scary. I don't know if these platforms are going to move. I'm guessing all of them except the center one will be moving. Whoa. Let's go. And wait, why are you just standing there? You're a toad, not Luigi. Usually Luigi tries to win by doing absolutely nothing. Not toad. Oh, get wrecked. Kicks are so powerful. Oh, punches are really powerful too. Okay, that was super easy. These toads really didn't give us much trouble at all. Good job, Yoshi. Goodbye, toad. So sad. Sit down, toad. So sad. And the boss fight is coming up now because we are going to floor number 10. Oh boy, this is very exciting. So we are going to get to a Bowser door here, right? Yep, here's a Bowser door. Time to head on in. Let's go. What's it gonna be? We walk in. It's a dark room. So cool to see Yoshi and Toad working together. Hey, who turned out the lights in here? We look ahead, it's a dark room. We can see who it is already. Is, is that what I think it is? This thing scared me so much as a kid. Ah, it's a chain jump! The chain jump in Super Mario 64 Ball on Battlefield was so scary. It would damage you so much when you walked into it. It would do three damage to you. Chain jumps, lava launch. Taunt the chain jump into jumping on the metal grates to damage it with lava. Okay, let's go my little chain jumpykins. I am going to defeat you. That's the voice that I normally use for Kamek. And it's so funny that when I do that voice, people in the comments, they go, wait, that sounds like the professor from Phineas and Ferb. That's so funny. And I showed my sister that voice too. And she said the, uh, she said the same thing. Wait, are you gonna jump now or are you gonna charge? Okay, he's just charging. Okay, come on, jump up, bro. Jump, bro. Jump, bro. There we are. Jumps up and he gets burned because when he goes on that, he falls into the lava. The lava comes up and hurts him. So he took some damage there. Now he's just gonna charge a little bit. Let's make him charge over here again. Oh, oh, he's jumping. And there we are. He took damage. Okay, he's almost half defeated. Let's go. Come here, my little chain chompikins. Come here, my chain Oh, boy. I didn't expect him to go there already. 
I thought he would charge this one more time. Okay, Chain Chomp is getting angry because he is more than half defeated now. So now we have to be careful because when he jumps, whoa, whoa, I thought that he would jump. I didn't think he would charge there. Okay, let's go, where are you going? Okay, charging again, are you gonna jump now? Jump, there we are, okay, so when he jumps, now lava comes up from all of these grates, so we have to be very careful. Okay, where are you going? Are you jumping or charging? Okay, just charging. Okay, one or two more hits to defeat him, let's see. Okay, let's stay here. And come on now, the boss fights in this game are so cool. And there we are, the chain jump is defeated. Look at the X's in his eyes. Oh, uh, stand for the chain jump. And Yoshi wins, another boss defeated. Okay, so floor 10 cleared, so we're about one third of the way through. Wow, that was an epic battle, but well, you made it. Great job, Yoshi. Thank you, Toad, we did make it, that was great. So let's keep going up the tower to floor 11. Now, oh, and Bowser's probably going to say something. Ah, should've spent more time training that chain chomp. Oh, and here's a preview of the next boss. Ah, never mind. I have a feeling my next guard will give you a perfectly chilly reception. Cause it's a snowman, that's so funny. So good luck with that. I'll just keep cranking out my evil bubbles. Whoa. All right, floor 11, is it still Toad's or is it someone else? Okay, still toads. So what mini game should we do? This one with ice blocks here where you carry penguins or this strawberry one? Let's, oh, you know what? I've done this one before, but I've never done this one. So let's try this. Color me fast. Color in the pictures of fruit on your touch screen. The first to complete three pages win. Okay, so that is so cool. The way that you use the stylus like that. Okay, so let's color in some fruit here. Okay, let's go. All uh, right, okay, one level complete. Okay, next we gotta color these pairs. Let's go color the pairs, color the pairs, color the pairs, and... Okay, pretty good, two complete. Oh boy, we gotta color some bananas over here. Okay, oh, I didn't think that one was done already. Okay, let's go. And just one more. Let's take our time, because the others, they're only done one. And there we are, the other toes, they only finished two max and we are done. What a nice victory for Yoshi. Lussle. Goodbye, Toads. Maybe on the next floor, we'll start to see someone else. If not on the next floor, then probably soon. Probably before the boss fight, we're going to start to see someone else. So we faced off against Bubble Daisies, Bubble Toads. I wonder when we'll see Bubble Yoshis. We didn't see Double Yoshis, did we? Because I took a break. Oh, Bubble Luigi's over here. How good do those Luigis look? That's so funny. Hey, look, it's Luigi. Wait, no, it's Bowser's three weird Luigi clones. Well, don't be fooled by their friendly demeanor. Take them out. What if the Luigis are like, ah, oh, Yoshi, I'm your friend. rat a tat flat or point and shoot. Let's do Rat-a-tat flat. Rat-a-tat flat, jump and grab out to squish as many scaredy rats as possible. I wonder what game these things originated in. I think they were in Paper Mario the Origami King, if I remember correctly, but they must have been around before that. They must have been around probably in, oh boy. Come on, yes, very nice. Maybe they were in uh, Luigi's Mansion. I don't know if that's where they originated though. Oh boy, that wasn't close enough, come on. Gold, we need the gold. Yeah, there we are, because the gold is worth three, so that's very nice. Gold! Give me the gold! Where are you guys? Wait, I got flattened, oh no. Where's the gold one, come here. Yes, and give me that one. Yes, okay, we're getting lots of gold, and come here. Come here, you little rat, oh. What, how did I not get that one? Okay, I squished the Luigi, I think, but not the gold rat at the end there. One of the Luigis had zero points there, and we had 17, so I think that was a very big victory for us. I saw one of the Luigis had two points. I'm not sure how many points the one in the bottom left had. I didn't see that. But that's a very nice victory for us. We can go up to floor 13. So floor 13 and 14 are probably both going to be Bubble Luigis again. And then floor 15 is going to be a boss fight, and then I wonder when we will have someone else to face off against. But let's see this. Oh, what is this? Hey, check it out! A roulette block! Somebody must have left it in here for us! How thoughtful! Well, I'll just give it a bump! So this is going to get rid of some of the Luigis. Let's see, what do we get? Yes! Good job! I think that means all three are defeated, right? Oh man, so we don't even have to play any of the mini games here. That would be very lucky if you were doing a speed run of this. Oh, and it looks like you just automatically go through the door on the left if you have all the Luigi's defeated. That is quite lucky. Man, doing speed runs of this would be really cool. It'd be really luck dependent though. Okay, is it still uh Luigi's again? Okay, it looks like it's Luigi's again. All right, let's go Luigi's. 
Which mini game do you want to play? Slip and oh, slip and slip. I thought it would be slip and slide or spin the bubble. Let's do slip and slip. A nice slippery ice one. This won't be too difficult, will it? We just have to be careful to not get pushed off by the penguins, and we want to not slide into the water. Okay, it's a bit icy here. Okay, so we've got to be careful. Whoa, 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 whoa! This is so much more slippery than expected. Okay, let's see. Where are you guys? Where are you guys? Okay, one fell. All right, how are the others doing? Oh no, he didn't fall, he didn't fall. I thought that he would fall because he was so close to falling. Okay, but, here, are you guys going to fall or no? What's going on with you guys? What's going on? Okay, there, now one fell. And look, we can see the Bubble Luigi in an ice cube like that. Okay, but what about the others? They're actually surviving so much longer than I thought they would. I'm doing pretty good at jumping over the penguins. Okay, now let's just see, let's see, are they off? There we are, okay, we survived. With 15 seconds left, we've got three ice cube Luigis up there. So it is goodbye to the Bubble Luigi's. Oh, look at how they waggle their legs like that when they lose. That's funny. I didn't notice that before. Oh, but now we are going to the boss fight. This is going to be very exciting. And this is one of the toughest boss fights, I think. No, into the dark room we go. Ah, more darkness. I'm sensing a theme here. Yeah, every fifth floor it's dark and we have a boss fight. That's right. Except this time, it seems a bit colder than usual. Because... Ah, no wonder, that's Mr. Blizzard! All right, Mr. Blizzard, I'm ready for this boss fight. Let's go Yoshi versus Mr. Blizzard. Mr. Blizzard Snow Slalom. Oh, it's actually pronounced slalom, apparently, and it is a ski race down a winding course marked by flags or poles. Throw the largest snowball possible before flinging it at Mr. Blizzard. Roll over the snow icons and avoid obstacles to grow your snowball. All right, let's give this a shot. This could be a tough one, so we basically have to roll this snowball on the bottom screen to control where Yoshi goes. We want to avoid the obstacles. Oh, and I think collecting those star things actually helps us. Okay, let's be careful with where we go. We don't want to get hit. Let's be very, very careful. Stay here. And how's that? Nice hit on him. That took out about a third of his health, so that's nice. All right, let's make our way down again. And don't hit me, bro. 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 Hit me, bro. I'm going for you. Let's go. There we go. Okay, he's at under half health now. That means that he's going to get angry now, so this is probably going to get more difficult now. Now he's throwing down some stuff. He's getting angry. He's an angry snowman. Okay, we've got to be careful because he is going to be an angry snowman that is throwing down lots of snowballs at us. Let's go around it. Oh, and there we are. He's got just a little bit of health left. Okay, now just be careful. Just don't get hit and you'll be great. I don't even care about collecting these things right now. I just want to not get hit. Go that way and... That's it, there we go! We got him, we definitely got him there. Mr. Blizzard has been defeated. Goodbye, Mr. Blizzard. And he just disappears into a cloud of smoke like that. And Yoshi is our champion. Yeah, so take a look at this. We're about halfway up the tower now, going up to floor 16. Really? You defeated Mr. Blizzard? That's actually kind of impressive. Oh, that's funny. I mean, ha, it means nothing. My next guard has an even more formidable mustache than Mario. Oh man, and look at him stomping his foot. We know who that's going to be. There's simply no way you're going to make it all the way to the top of my tower. It's inconceivable. All right, Bowser, we'll see about that. Maybe we will make it to the top. Oh, and look at this now. It is Bubble Princess Peaches. We defeated the Bubble Luigis. Ah, not Peach. This is no way to treat a princess. Oh, that one's so nice. But these aren't the real Princess Peaches. We can do Amp My Style instead of Cramp My Style or Tap Dash. Let's try Tap Dash. Tap Dash, match the characters on the top screen by tapping the appropriate panel on the touch screen as quickly as possible. All right, I don't think I've played this before. Oh, so then you have to tap the spiny. Okay, I see. All right, so whatever's up there, we have to tap that as quickly as possible. Let's see, okay. Oh, and there are three rounds. Okay, so what's first? Uh, Swiffer, right there, we got it. All right, very nice. Wait. Why is it taking the other so long? Oh, they didn't even get it. That's so sad for them. Okay, what's next? Let's see. It is fuzzy. That's right there. Okay, very nice. Okay, we are quite fast. Oh, now they're starting to get it. Well, the last one didn't get it. Okay, final round. Will we get a perfect game or no? Let's see. What is it? 
It is dry bones right there. Okay, man, I wish this had more rounds because this is actually quite fun. I like this mini game a lot. That's actually a very fun mini game. Like a reaction test and you have to find something quickly. Goodbye, Bubble Princess Peaches. We will see you again, most likely on the next floor. And yeah, let's take a look at this. Here we are on the tower. We are more than halfway up now. That's quite nice. We're making our way up. Is Bowser gonna give us a punishment now? Yeah, not so fast. Before I allow you to play another mini game, I've got a surprise for you. It's a random punishment. Whoa, because climbing the tower isn't hard enough already. So we'll just take a quick look at Bowser's list and see what delightful penalty I get to inflict. Fun. And it is... Get one million Mario Party points, maybe that'd be nice. Oh, it is, but I don't think he's actually gonna... Well, I guess I have to hand over one million Mario Party points. Whoa! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I just can't say that with a straight face. You didn't think that was really going to happen, did you? Go on, earn your own points. Whoa! <laughs> ah, Bowser. That would have been so nice if you gave us those million party points. Oh, both of these minigames actually look really cool, and we are up against Bubble Princess Peaches again. So, our options are thanks a lot instead of thanks a lot, or stretch run. You know, I've never tried this one. Let's see what this is. Stretch run. Stretch the rubber band to launch your cart as far as possible without going over the edge. So there's a mini game. Oh, oh, this is so cool. That's so cool. Okay, so it's like a rubber band and then you see how far you get launched. And... Toad went a little bit too far. Blue Toad fell off. That is very sad for him. Okay, so let's see if we can do all right at this. There's a minigame kind of like this in We Party U. Start. Except it's on, uh, you go on skateboards. Okay, let's stay around there. Let's see how that is. Oh, I'm at basically the same position as all of them. But let's see how we all do. And, okay, we all get one point, so that's all right. Okay, so we can go a bit farther than that. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! The later ones are worth a lot more points now. Okay. So hold on. Last time, we were around here. Let's go. How's that? Hopefully this is all right. Oh, they're going very far back. I think the red and yellow might fall off. Hopefully they fall off. Let's see. We don't want them to survive. And... Yes! Okay, goodbye to those. Oh, boy. I was playing that so safely. I was very scared. Wait, did that person get one point there, or did I only get one here? Let's see, okay, it looks like we win. Are all of the Princess Peaches defeated? I'm guessing they're all defeated, right? Yeah, oh, so sad for the princesses, so sad. That was a really cool mini game to try, even though I played that very conservatively there because I was very scared I didn't want to fall off too far, so it's a very good thing that we did that. Okay, floor 18, wow, and we're already almost at another boss fight. Okay, still Princess Peaches. I wonder if the next floor will be Bubble Peaches or Bubble someone else. Now, what are the options? Quickest Cricket? or mild gunmen instead of wild. Let's do this one. I don't think I've ever done this one before. Wait for a button to appear on the target and then press it as quickly as possible to fire a paintball. All right, this sounds simple enough. Just be ready to press a button as quickly as possible. Oh, there's Toad. Toad hit B. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so whoever gets their paintball onto the target first is the winner. Let's see, so it's A, B, X, and Y. Let's see, what do we have to press? X. Yeah, we're fast. Okay, 0. 0.6. Okay, we could have done that a bit faster, maybe. Oh, some of them missed. Okay, they're very slow. Let's see. Let's try and go as fast as possible. Hopefully, it's A. I got my finger on the A button. Let's see. Ah, I hit A instead of X. Oh, my goodness, because I just wanted to be fast. Oh, oh, and they tied perfectly. Okay, so I actually have to win this round. Otherwise, we lose the mini game. Why? Oh, and that was even faster. I wasn't even trying to go fast there, but that was even faster than the first time. So, do we win overall? I hope that we do win. Let's see. Okay, next, we do still win. Okay, even though I made a mistake in round two because I just wanted to press A quickly. Goodbye, Princess Peaches. I wonder if we are going to see you again on the next floor or someone else. I guess we're going to find out. And after that is the next boss fight. And the last two boss fights are really cool. This is going to be the third last boss fight coming up in a moment. Now, is this Princess Peach or someone else? Let's see. Oh, it is now Bubble Waluigi. Look how evil they look. They're like, hey, it's a Waluigi time. Waluigi number one. And here are some bizarro Waluigis. To be honest, they're not that different from the real Waluigi. You know what to do. That's so funny. They're not too different from the normal one. And he calls them bizarro. Okay, bob on the plum or Cheapers Keepers. Let's do Cheapers Keepers. Press the selected button as fast as you can to reel in Cheap Cheeps. So do you only have to hit the button once when the prompt comes up? Or do you keep mashing it until it changes? I'm not sure how it works. Oh, oh, it looks like you keep mashing it. 
And you want to pull it in. Okay, okay, so let's see. What button are we going to be mashing? Let's get ready to do some mashing. Round one. Oh, and I wonder if it's only going to be a... Uh... Well, let's focus. Ah, X. Let's go. Okay, I actually hit A first. Oh, oh, and it's how many times you press the button. That's how many cheap cheeps you get. That's so good. I really like this. This might end up becoming one of my favorite minigames. Okay, what's the button going to be? What is it? Why? Okay, I don't know if that was better. I did double thumb mashing, but it took me a second to find the Y button. Okay, we did the same. Okay, I hope that it's A. If it's A, then I'll be ready for it. If it's a different button, then I have to get ready for it. Let's see. Start. Come on, give me A. B. Okay, that was all right. That was all right. That is super fun. I like this video game. Wait, I don't think that there's a max of 17 every time. I probably just happened to hit it 17 times every time. Wait, and their scores were 15, 12, and 15. So in a single round, I got more than they got in all three rounds. That's quite funny. Goodbye, Waluigi's. Oh, and next is the boss fight. I almost forgot about that. And it's going to be the King bob -omb boss fight, right? Hold on, right now I'm thinking about the King bob -omb boss fight from Mario Party 9, but this one's different. What is this one like? I don't even remember what this one is like. I guess we're about to find out. <laughs> ah! Dark room! Ominous shadows! We look forward. Can we see him? Yeah, we can see his mustache and gloves there and his boots. This usually means we're in trouble! And the camera zooms over. Oh dear! I knew it was bad, but I didn't know it was this bad! That's King bob -omb. Okay, Mr. King bob -omb, let's battle! Yoshi versus King bob -omb. This reminds me of Super Mario 64 DS. Oh, it's this! Okay, I remember how it works now. King bob -omb's Court of Chaos! Send King bob -omb's bombs back to him by sliding the conveyor belt panels until they line up. Let's go! Mini game that you play using the stylus. So this should be fine. We just have to slide over these panels, and then we'll send the bombs back to King bob -omb. Oh, and I guess you want to send it into the golden pipes because you get more points for that. Let's get ready to send these back. We can go like... Oh, wait. There we go. Now we can move it. Okay, let's see. We can go like... That... And now, there we are. I'm ready. Okay, with 13 seconds left, we managed to send a bomb to Mr. King bob -omb, so that'll be very good. Let's go. And there we are! A nice hit hub just shot a cannon right into his face. Okay, so let's see. We'd like to get something that goes there, so we can just go like that. Easy! 14 seconds left this time. Even better. Last time we had 13 seconds left, but now we have 14 seconds left, so that's quite nice. And he's half defeated, so he's getting angry now. Got an angry King bob -omb. what's he gonna do? Okay, now one more row is being added? Yeah, it looks like one more row is being added. Okay, so this could get a bit tricky. Let's see, can we go like that? Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, 14 seconds left again. That's very nice that we did that. That wasn't super tricky. And there are probably multiple solutions that you can use for this to get the bomb to where you want it to go. Okay, so just one more and then we win. Let's see. Go like this. Like that. We can make one come uh, like this. And can we get anything nice like that? Oh no, it's about to explode. Oh, they're moving. They're moving. Oh no. Okay, let's just go like that. That's fine. Okay, with four seconds left, we managed to get a good thing. The bomb didn't explode on us. That's very nice. Okay, now that's gonna do just a bit of damage. Okay, now let's be careful. Let's see how can we do this. Oh, and there we are. Okay, that was super easy with 17 seconds left. I think we only had to do two movements there to get the bomb to the golden cannon. Too bad we didn't get all golden cannons, but that's all right. Another boss defeated without any damage at all. That's very nice. Goodbye, King bob -omb. And Yoshi is the winner. Congratulations, Yoshi. We have some very victorious music playing when we win here. Hooray! Another level complete. Oh! Thank you for saving me, Yoshi! I'm allergic to bombs, you see! What a funny line. That is quite funny for Toad to say that. Toad is allergic to bombs. Wait, can Toad be near bob bombs then? Or is he just talking about he's allergic to explosions? Ugh, poor King bob -Bomb. Up in smoke. What's next, Yoshi? Who are you? <laughs> oh, but look at who the next guard is. This is actually such a cool boss fight that's coming up. Ugh, whatever. The next guard is a close family friend. <laughs> Can you guys see who that boss is? Oh, it looks a little scary. What's it gonna be? Everything up until now has been child's play compared to what you're about to face. 
Good luck! <laughs> I think the hardest boss to do damage this is actually Mr. Blizzard, though. Okay, so we're facing off against more Bubble Wall Luigi's. And what minigame are we going to pick here? Mario Kart or the music one? No traction action or Xylophone Home. I don't know if I've done this one before, so let's give this a shot. No traction action. Slide and bump your way to the finish line over three slippery laps. Sounds simple enough. You just use A and B in the joystick. Oh, this is so cool how we're all lined up on carts like this, but wait. Is our steering wheel even connected to anything? Ah, oh, okay, it looks like the rest of the car is there. We can just see through the car. Hey, wait, are we on the inside or outside? Okay, it looks like we're going this way. Whoa! Whoa, 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 The steering is so wild in this. It's so slippery here. Really is very slippery, okay. Let's see. How are we doing? Okay, one lap complete. Will we be able to lap the others? It'd be wild if we played so well that we could catch up to the others and lap them here. Let's see. All right, doing good, I think. I don't know how far ahead we are of the others, but we are in first, which is nice. Let's just spin around here, and we didn't lap them, and we didn't get to see where they were, so I don't know how far ahead we are, but we did win. That's the important thing. New record. I really like how he says new record there. So on the next floor, are we going to have someone else? Goodbye, Bubble Wall Luigi's. Oh, and the other thing to also consider is if Bowser is going to give us another punishment now. So far, his punishments haven't been bad at all. There's one time, I think, that he made the CPUs more difficult. But other than that, we haven't had any major issues. Oh, these mini games can be tricky. Okay, and it's still Bubble Wall Luigi's. Floor 22. Which mini game do we want to play? Tragic Carpet Ride? Oh, instead of Magic Carpet Ride. Or Get Real. I don't think I've played this one before. But you know what? Let's try this one since this is new for me. Get Real. Wait, I think I actually have played this one. I think I have played both of them. Get Real. Wind the film back and forth to find the frame pictured on your touch screen. Okay, I think I actually have played this one before. Okay, so we want to wind clockwise and counterclockwise to find the same frame. We need the two pictures to match up. So let's see what it's going to be. Okay, so there's Mario on a paper airplane like that. So let's see what way do we go? Okay, is this right? No, because there's a green balloon under him over here. So let's see. Is that it? No, one more. That looks good. All right, first. Okay. Oh, we actually barely beat them there. That was a little tricky. Okay, so let's see what the next one is going to be. Okay, so now it's Mario popping out of a pipe over here. We want to get to the right moment, okay? Let's see where his hands are up like that. Oh, so it must be when he comes out of the pipe. Hold on. Oh, like that or... No, 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 no. It's when he's coming down. Go a bit back. Oh, no! Fourth place! That's awful! Oh, man. This is actually so tricky. Okay, now we need Mario running away from a peepa. Okay, so let's go. Let's go. We gotta come in first here. Let's see. Is that the one? You know what? I think that's the one. There we go. Okay, first place there. Okay. And we're tied in first. Oh boy, it's 18, 18, 9, and 9. I think we do still win, even though it's a tie like this, right? Let's see. Okay, so it looks like if you tie the CPUs, then it still counts as a win in this game mode. I'm guessing that's the way that it works. Because that's what it seems like, because we have had a few ties. And it looks like when you tie them, they're defeated. If you lose, then I think you have to redo the minigame again. Oh wait, yeah, I'm pretty sure you do have to redo the minigame again if you lose. I think that's what happened. Okay, so what's now? Floor 23. Is it Waluigi's or someone else? Let's see. Oh, it is now Bubble Wario's. It's a Wario time. Let's go, Yoshi. We are going to have a battle. Oh, man. Bowser even made copies of Wario. Though I really don't think it'd be more mischievous than the real Wario. Okay. Oh, nice. And a roulette block. So some of the Wario's might be defeated right now. They look so eager to battle right now. Look at their faces. Somebody must have left it here for us. How thoughtful. Well, I'll just give it a bump. How many do you get rid of? Two this time. Okay, so now we only have to defeat one Wario. That's not bad. These mini games haven't been too difficult so far anyways. Okay, so the mini game choices are Bumper Thumper and Buzz a Fuzzy. So let's do Bumper Thumper. Fire your boosters and bump the other player off the platform. This mini game seems simple enough. All you have to do is use your joystick. Oh, but this is scary because you can knock them off. Oh, and down there, the characters, they almost look like paper cutouts. Wait. Oh, oh, that's the way that it works. It's like you can move a little bit and come on. Oh, 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 it's like when you bump into these, that's when the platform starts to go down. I was wondering, wait, when did these actually start to come down? Go there, come on, come on, and come on, 
Come on. Yo, gotta get it. There we go. Oh, boy. It almost looked like he fell off by himself. That was quite funny. The bottom there actually reminds me of the theme park level from Super Mario Sunshine, which was a great game that I'd really like to revisit. I never finished it as a kid, actually. Goodbye, Bubble Wario. Oh, he falls on his back like that. That's so sad. Okay. Now we can head through here, one more Bubble Wario battle, and then it is the second last boss fight of the game, which is a really, really cool one. And we're getting so close to the top of the tower. Look at this, guys. Look at how close we are to the top of the tower. All right, Bubble Warios, I'm ready to battle you guys. What mini game shall we choose now? Well, the options are Pokey Coral or Starring Artist instead of Starving Artist. Let's give this one a shot. This is probably with the stylus. I don't remember if I've played this or not. Starring Artist, use your stylus to copy the constellations you see on the top screen as quickly as possible. Okay, I am ready. Let's go. So here's the demonstration. Okay, so then you want to make a star like that. Okay, simple enough. Oh, and that apparently makes a Goomba. Oh, so now we have to make two of these. Okay, so let's go. We want to make a, what is this called? The Trapezoid? and a hexagon there we are first in round one very nice okay they weren't very far behind the one on the right it's supposed to be an amp it kind of looks like a ghastly oh boy wait where do i even put these how in the world does this work hey okay, let's go to that one nope that's wrong okay there and uh, then is it just across like that okay there's that and wait where are these connected i don't even know where i have to connect these let's go where do I connect that? Oh, that's up there. Oh, no. I didn't realize that that was up there. Okay, that's actually very bad. Okay, final round. Okay, so we better do well here. Let's see. Like that and like that. Okay, now this one. Gotta go like that and like that. And then are these just all connected here or how? Wait. Oh, it's a square. Okay, good. We're first there. Okay, do we win or no? Let's see. Okay, nice! We were able to tie the CP, so that does mean that we do win. It's so nice that ties are considered wins in this game mode, because if you ever make a big mistake like I just made in that minigame, you don't have to redo the minigame, it still counts a victory, that's very nice. Oh, and it's floor 25, so that means that it is about to be a boss fight now, and this is actually a super cool boss fight that is coming up. Let's head on in. Let's go, Yoshi and Toad. Oh, uh, here we are. We are in a dark room. At this point, I would be surprised if the lights were on. That's so funny. By this point, every fifth floor is already dark. And look at who the boss is. Sure is dusty in here. Cough, cough. I just said cough instead of making a coughing sound. Oh, maybe that dry Bowser over there has something to do with it. Oh, man. And look at how his eyes glow like that. Quite the scary boss fight. It is now Yoshi versus dry Bowser. Dry Bowser's Brain Bog. Okay, so you have to hit one of those buttons. Press the buttons in the correct order to send Dry Bowser's bones flying back at him. This is a really exciting boss fight. This is one of my favorite boss fights. You have to be really quick with the buttons that you have to press. So let's see. Let's see what it's gonna be. We gotta be ready to whack it back at him. Okay, start. Okay, let's see. What is it gonna be? Y, Y, A. Okay. Oh, oh. Wait. Why, why, hey, oh, okay, okay, I thought that I had to press it earlier. I was trying to press it already. I thought, wait, why is it not showing up? Okay, X, B, X, okay, that's very easy. Let's go. There we are, plenty of time to send back X, B, X. Okay, this is super easy. For some reason, I thought this would be more difficult. Okay, A, X, B, okay, let's go. A, X, B, easy. There we are, send it back to him, and he is half defeated. Getting very angry, he roars. L-R-Y-B, okay. L-R-Y-B. Very nice. And if I make a mistake, I can't really go back and correct it. Okay, oh! Uh, D-pad. D-pad R-L-A. All right, there we go. Sent it back to him. Very nice. If I make a mistake, then I get hit and I take damage. L-B-R-L. Okay, that's a bit tricky. L-B-R-L. Very nice. Okay, is it gonna get to five soon? Oh! R-A-R-B-X, okay, R-A-R-B-X, R-A-R-B-X, okay, and that was a big bone, oh my goodness, and there we go, he's defeated, okay, so the final bone is that five over there, goodbye, Dry Bowser, oh, and he just poofs into a cloud of smoke like that, congratulations, Yoshi, I love that we're still holding the hammer, too, good job, Yoshi, Little. So, one more floor complete. We are going to the final five floors now. Wow, not even that boss could rattle you. Way to go, Yoshi. That's so funny that he used the word rattle because 
rattle. People often say bones are rattling if you're scared, so Toad said not even that boss could rattle you. That's quite funny. I don't know if I noticed that before. I can't believe it. Dry Bowser failed me. Ugh. Well, Yoshi, you leave me no choice. I'll just have to stop you myself. If you make it this far, be prepared to face Bowser. I'll show you the full extent of my power. <laughs> All right, Bowser, let's go. Who are we facing over here? Oh, Bubble Wario cell. So, okay, so soon is probably gonna change into someone else. Maybe Bubble Yoshi's. All right, which mini game do you wanna play? Blown Hover or Shrub Hubbub? Wait, is this meant to be a pun on blown cover? Well, let's do this mini game. Blown Hover, race to the finish while jumping and dodging the flip panels as they appear. Okay, so this is a little tricky. We want to be careful to not get hit by those. Yeah, you can either jump. Wait, can we also move? Oh, if you bump into the others, you kind of get in their way a little bit. Oh, oh, that's good. Okay, so now we're ahead of them. Not for long, not for long. Oh no, they're ahead of me already. Oh no, let's go here. Let's see, be careful to not get hit. Come here, jump. Okay, let's see where we're going. Jump. Let's try and not get hit. Hey, get away from me. Okay, good, good, good. Now we're in the lead again. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Don't get hit. Where are you gonna go? Where are you going, bro? I'm jumping up here. Okay, where are you going? Ah! Oh boy, that was scary. Okay, jump over. Very nice. Now where are you going? Okay, you're going there. That's fine. And what about you? Can I jump over you, please? Don't fail in those spots. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I really hope they don't catch up to us now. Oh boy, we can go there. So close to the end. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, and that is the end. I was so worried that they would catch up to us because we got hit near the end there, but we did win the race. That is fantastic. New record. Oh, new record. Very nice. Thank you, sir. Goodbye, Bubble Warios. Is the next floor going to be a different bubble creature? Because there's 27, 28, 29. There are three more floors. Of three, there are three more regular floors, and then the final floor, floor 30, is gonna be the boss fight. Not so fast! Before I allow you to play another mini game, I've got a surprise for you! It's a random punishment! Because climbing the tower isn't hard enough already. Let's see what it is. Let's take a quick look at Bowser's list. Please don't be fall down one floor. Start over again on the first floor would be so sad. Go directly to the top floor! All right, it's decided. You're hereby invited to the top floor. Wait, what? I can't allow that. What kind of boss would I be if I just let heroes visit my fortress without a fight? Whoa! <laughs> Sorry to get your hopes up, but you'll still have to reach the top all by yourself. I've been super lucky with Bowser's punishments this time. They've all been very nice. Now, which one do we want? Let's see. And who is it? Oh, it's Bubble Bowser Juniors! That's so cool! Look at them! Aww. That's so nice. It reminds me of Super Mario Sunshine. Ink! It's Bowser's strange copies of Bowser Jr. Make him go away! Let's make him go away. Okay, so the minigame options are Bounce and Bounce or Garden of Eaton instead of Eden. That's a funny pun. Let's do this one. Garden of Eaton. Pick a plant to water and hope for the best. Piranha plants are mixed in among regular flowers. Okay, I didn't know that this was going to be a luck-based one, so let's see which one will be the piranha plant. It is... Come on now. Okay, the guy on the left got eaten and the guy on the right had a good one. Okay, which one do we want to grow then? Let's do this one right here. That's the one I choose. Wait, where are they running around? They're just running left and right. Guys, you don't have a lot of time. You got to pick a flower soon. Hopefully we're okay. Let's see. We all water it and... Come on. Come on. And... Yes! Wait, do we all win then or does it keep going? Oh no! Okay, let me take this one then. Okay, there are four plants now. Wait, does that mean that only one of these plants will let you survive now? I wonder how it works. Let's see. Because if we get this, that's insanely lucky. If that's the way it works. Ah, oh, man. I only had a one in four chance of getting it and we didn't get it. That's so sad. Too bad. So sad. Yoshi bounces around. Game over. So sad. Look at Yoshi bouncing around. That's so sad. It's actually very nice that we got to see this game over screen. Kind of cool to see Yoshi bouncing around like this. Okay, but the nice thing is we can just go back to the mini game and try again. All right, let's see if we can get it this time. Hopefully this time we can get it. Okay, everybody picked a flower. I like how we pick every second flower. That's quite nice. Please tell me they all get out right away. That'd be perfect. Come on. Okay, two of them got out. Okay, now it's 1v1. 1v1 me, bro. Which one's it gonna be? This one's looking quite stationary, so I'm really hoping that I'm safe here. Let's see. We might both survive or both get out. Or maybe only one will survive. Okay, we both survived. Oh, no. Now it's down to a 50-50 chance. Blue or yellow? I'll pick this yellow one. Hopefully we're safe here. 
Let's go, bro. Please let us win this one. Please, please, please. 50-50 chance. Please, I don't want a piranha plant for Yoshi. Please. No! You know what we could do? Instead of doing this luck-based minigame, we could do a skill-based minigame. Trounce and bounce. Bump your opponents out of the way and aim for the jump blocks as you fall. Yeah, I should have actually just done this last time. Okay, so we are bouncing like this. We want to push them out of the way. And we want to land on any of these spots here. Okay, everyone got bounced up. That's fine. Now, how many are there? Okay, there are six to land on, so there should be room for everybody. Let's see. Okay, everyone still survived. They're actually doing great so far. Oh, but now there are only three. Can we share any of these or no? I don't know if we can share these. Possibly. Oh, look at this. A roulette block appeared because we lost here so many times. That's kind of funny. Okay, how many do we get rid of? Okay, we only got rid of one, so that doesn't even help too much. But, yeah, it's kind of funny that we haven't really had any trouble here yet in this entire playthrough. But now, on floor 27, all of a sudden, we're having a lot of trouble. So hopefully we can do all right in this minigame. And I've also added another screen to the right over there so we can see how, uh, how high we are. Oh, boy, I almost got out in the first round. Okay, come on, I gotta beat these two guys over here. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Don't get in our way. And, whoa, they almost pushed me off near the end. Okay, this is a little scary. Okay, let's see. Okay, there are three, so there's room for all of us here, or at least there should be room for all of us here. Oh, I almost pushed that guy off. Okay, now 1v1! 1v1 me, bro! The two of us, we've got to fight for this. Gotta push him, gotta push him, gotta push him. No! Give me a better block! Okay, just one, that's fine. This mini game should not be this hard. Let's just see, find a nice spot to go! Okay, we all survived that round, that's alright. Okay, now it's just Yoshi and two Bowser Jr. bubble clones. Push them out of the way. Oh, you can actually have multiple people land on the same one. At least that's what it looked like. Okay, let's see, where are you guys going? Move, move. Yeah, we both landed on that one over there. Yeah, so you definitely can have multiple people landing on the same one. Or at least up to two people landing on the same one. No! I don't know if this is attempt, what, four or five? How many tries has this taken? They just keep eliminating us. Okay, there we go, I forced that guy out, that was nice. Maybe this is a good strategy. Just don't even try and land. Just try and push the others off. Just try and get rid of him. Oh boy, that was a little risky. I almost fell off myself. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna try and push this guy away. Nope, nope, nope. You can't have it. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go right there. Right on the edge of that. Okay. Now only one to go. Let's see. Push him, 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 push him. Wait, is that a tie? Does that count a tie or does that count a lose? Let's see. Oh my goodness, we are the winner because it's a tie. Oh man, we couldn't even win barely. That's so funny. Okay, but we are finally making it past this floor. We are going to floor 28 next. Man, how many attempts did it take us to get past floor 27? And we are almost at the top now, which is very nice. Look at how close we are to the top. Oh, and now we have a choice of two mini games here. Okay, and still Bowser Jr. bubble clones over here. So let's see what mini game we're going to choose here. We can choose hide and splat or Slipknot. So this minigame I have played for sure. Slipknot, I don't think I have played, and it's actually hilarious that they called this minigame Slipknot. I'm guessing that's making a reference to the band Slipknot, which is fantastic. Slide as far as you can without slipping off the path. Okay, so we want to make it to those crystals over there, and we want to make it before the others fall off. Hold on, let's actually do this so that we can see when the others fall off. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we can tilt a little bit one way, tilt a little bit the other way. And just gotta be careful to not fall. That's the most important thing. Oh, someone already fell. Okay, that's great. This actually reminds me a little bit of the unicycle minigame. Oh, wait. Did we go the farthest? We didn't reach the end, but I think we might have went the farthest. And as I was saying, that one actually reminds me a little bit of the unicycle minigame from Wii Party U. There's something similar to that, but you tilt the Wiimote left and right, and you want to not fall off a path instead of it being water. It's so interesting how similar minigames can be between different games. Okay, floor 29, the last normal floor before the final boss fight. So what minigame are we going to choose here? Kebab and Weave? Or Flip Out. This one I have played before. I don't know if I've played Flip Out before, so let's try this one. Race and jump across platforms and flumps to the finish line. Okay, so here's the demo. So I guess you want to jump at the right moment. Wait! Okay, Toad got flipped back to the very beginning. That's a little scary. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh, you just press A when you want to jump. Oh, let's wait. Go, go. Oh, no! 
Oh, oh, it doesn't send you back to the very beginning. It looks like it just sends you back a little bit, actually. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Flip. Come on! No! Yes! Yes! Very good. Okay, I was a little scared towards the end there, but that went great. All right, so there is our final main mini game. Now we're going through the door on the right, and we are going up to the very top floor of the tower. Let's have a look here. There we are, the top floor of the tower. Who's going to be in here? Let's go inside and see. It's dark, as always, on every fifth floor. This is it, Yoshi! It's time to face your strongest opponent yet! Who's it going to be? What if it's Mario? That'd be so funny if it was just Mario. Welcome! How do you like the place? I hope my associates have made you feel welcome. <laughs> But, enough chit-chat, I'm pretty busy sucking the fun out of the party islands and trapping it in tiny bubbles. And, you're the only person in my way, so let's see if you've got what it takes. Bring it on! This is it! You made it this far! I just know you can win! Let's see, the camera zooms over, and it is Bowser! Time to battle Bowser! Yoshi versus Bowser final boss fight! Bowser's Sky Scuffle! This is going to be an intense mini game with a lot of stuff happening. These graphics actually look pretty good for the 3DS. This is upscaled because we are playing an upscaled version so that the graphics look better. But it's pretty cool how they have the clouds moving like that. Alright, and I'm ready to face off against Bowser. Do we want to dodge Bowser's attacks? And we also want to fire cannonballs back at Bowser. Oh, I'm aiming at him right now. Okay, wait, let's see. Oh boy, oh boy, how do we get him? And oh boy, I missed, and come on, come here, Bowser. This is so hard to aim. Go, nope, go. Yeah, we got him once, and okay, I got him once in all of that time. I guess it could probably be worse. Now what, now do I have to dodge Bowser's attacks? Oh, wait, what is this gonna do? What's that one? Oh, those are the number of cannonballs that I'm going to have to shoot at Bowser. Yeah. Oh, get it. Yes! Oh boy, avoid the fire. Good jump. Oh, I thought that was fire coming towards me too. Whoa. Okay, Bowser, stump with the fire. Give me the three. Yes! Whoa! Okay, good, good, good. Okay, now we have a lot of cannonballs. Whoa! I thought you were done shooting fire. Let's go, bro. Come on. That's enough, bro. Let's relax here. All right. Time to shoot at Bowser. Let's go. Where are you, bro? Where are you, bro? Come here. Come here. Go. Yes. Yes. Oh, no. Very bad. Where are you, bro? Oh, man. My aim is so bad. Let's see. Oh, no. Go. Yes. Oh, he's half defeated. Bowser's angry now. Yeah, Bowser's yelling a lot over here. He's very angry. Okay, so he's half defeated. We haven't taken any damage yet, so there probably is a chance that we can win this. Hopefully, we can do well. Don't hurt me! Oh boy! Oh boy, what if I jump off? I wonder if you can jump off. Oh, what's that going to be? Whoa! Get the- good, we got the cannonball. Very nice, okay. I was worried that shockwaves would get sent out when Bowser landed there. Give me the three, let's go! We got three cannonballs. Okay, so we have max cannonballs right now. Okay, where are those going to go? They're coming down. We can see that they're coming down. Oh, and you're coming here too! And now I'm gonna run here, and I'm getting ready to attack you, bro. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where are you, bro? You're over there. Let's just get you right... Stop moving, bro. Relax. Oh, no. Oh, no. Bad job. Come on, stop dodging all my attacks. There we go. Wait, did I get him? Stop moving, bro. Come on, I was, I was supposed to get you there. Come on. Stop moving. Relax, bro. Stop moving. And... Oh, no, I used up the last of the cannonballs. Okay, that's okay. We did very little damage on him. It's so hard to aim like this, actually. Okay, so let's see, where are we gonna go now? Give me one! There we go, we got one cannonball, that's lovely. Hopefully we can get some more. Okay, where are those falling? Okay, we can avoid them. Oh, Bowser's coming too! I want this three though. There we go, three more cannonballs for us, that's amazing. Now can we also get the two? There we go, we got the two, okay, now where- Oh, no! We got hit, I thought it would actually push us off the level. Wait, can we jump off? I don't want to try it, I don't want to try it, I'm very worried actually. Okay, let's get ready. Hey, where are you, Bowser? Right there. Oh, no. Right... Oh, you stopped for a moment. Let's go. There we go. No, stop moving, bro. Bro, stop moving, stop moving, stop moving. Relax. There we are. And come on, stop moving, stop moving. Let me just get a nice hit on you. Wait. Just wait, bro. Stop it. No! Oh, man. 
Okay, we need some more cannonballs. This actually reminds me a bit of one of the last bosses in Donkey Kong 64. Such a fun game, even though... Oh! Oh, that actually changes! I didn't realize that those blocks can change because that was a 2, but it became a 3 right before we hit it, so that was actually perfect for us. This one also became a 3. There we go. Now wait, so does that mean that this phase is going to end? Oh! That actually hit us. That's bad. We're at almost half health. That's actually very bad, but Bowser's still attacking. Relax with the attacks, Bowser! Relax with the attacks. That's enough attacking, Bowser. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's see. Where are you going, bro? Go. No! No, you must stop. Go. Yes! Come on, I got four shots. I got four shots left. Nope, three shots left. Why didn't you move that way? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Just do your laugh. Do your laugh. I'm ready for you. Oh, no! That was awful! Out of six shots, I got one on him. That is very, very bad. This is so difficult. Okay, hopefully we can aim better for the last one. If we get to six here, and I think if we get two shots on him, then we might be able to defeat him this time. Hopefully we don't have to keep going very far. Oh no, I jumped into the fire. Okay, our health is at less than half now. We've got about one third HP. That's actually very bad. Can you imagine if we lost this, especially so close to the end when Bowser has so little HP left? Oh, don't come here, bro gonna run right here. I'm gonna be ready to shoot you, bro. I'm gonna be ready, bro. I'm ready, bro. Let's go. Just need some very, very careful shots. Let's see. When are you gonna laugh? Just laugh, bro. Are you gonna laugh? Laugh. Nice! Come on now. Laugh, bro. Laugh. When are you gonna laugh? You gonna laugh, bro? You gonna laugh? And there we go! With three cannonballs left. That's so good. When you take the time to focus, you can do so much better. Haste amounts to waste. And there we are, Bowser's clown car explodes. Bowser's blasting off again! And then his star appears like that. And Yoshi is the winner. Good job, Yoshi. Oh boy, that was actually a lot tougher than I remember it being. What's going to happen now that we've completed this? So the final floor is complete. What does Toad have to say about that? Whoa! You really did it, Yoshi! You took on Bowser and beat him at his own game! But wait, is there more to the game? Ha! Huh? Looks like Bowser is making his bubbles up on the roof! Let's go put a stop to his madness! Is there a round two to the boss fight, maybe? A lot of boss fights do have round two, but I don't know about this game. Let's see. Yoshi and Toad run up the stairs. A giant Bowser statue at the top of the tower like this. Ah! This must be the machine he's using! Let's destroy it! Yes, yeah, so let's indeed destroy the machine. Oh, but look at all the bubbles! All Bubble Mario's over here! Oh! Should've known Bowser would employ some of his toughest! No, oh, this tough is something. That was too fast to read. Uh-oh, now the Marios are coming towards us. Yoshi just bounces off all the Marios. And is he gonna ground pound on it now? Oh, I love the sound effect of Yoshi jumping like that. Yoshi ground pounds on the machine and does that destroy it? But wait, where's Bowser? Is Bowser going to come here now? Bowser going to change his ways? He a changed character now? I like how those bubbles pop. And... Congratulations! We did it! Uh -huh. Oh, but wait! But wait! There's more! What is happening? This looks like a secret ending to the game. Whoa! You celebrate too soon! That wasn't even my final form! That's such a great line. And here he is! The thing you defeated was merely a bubble decoy. Now, I'll show you the real me. So this makes it sound like there's going to be another boss fight or a final form of the boss fight. I can do anything! Take this! What's he gonna do? Oh! He just punches us! A fist and a spring just came out like that. Now we're the ones that are blasting up. If you really want to stop me, you must challenge me again! Because this isn't over. I welcome you back to Bowser's Tower anytime! <laughs> just a friendly reminder, be sure to take breaks from playing. I really recommend you watch my video where Luigi wins by doing nothing versus Bowser in Chaos Castle in Mario Party 10. That video just recently passed 1 million views and that blows my mind. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you have an amazing day ahead of you, and take care, everybody.